Hey, big at Homestead fam. I got these uh, discount strawberries and I want to try out the Dollar Tree Expanding Soil. So let's plant these together. Hi, welcome to Big Hat Homestead. Today I will be testing this Dollar Tree Expanding Soil. It makes about three quarts and you can do one of these five options. It expands 10 times its size and is listed as organic. Let's go ahead and give this a try. And here it is, you just add water. Expands in minutes, makes three quarts. Okay, let's give it a try. gonna do is get in here and see if it will expand in there. I initially poured water over the brick but it works better if you soak it in the water. It's kind of messy. Yeah it is expanding. And it says kind of stir it to help it once it expands. Hmm. Interesting. The mixture is very fibrous. It feels like coconut core and peat moss mixed together. Let this sit for a few minutes. This is kind of thick. Let's pour this in here now. It's probably about five minutes. Oh, it is a lot. Wow, it filled up this whole thing, that one brick. So I'm gonna take this strawberry plant, take off this leaf. And I don't know if I would um, just use that by itself. It feels a little like it needs something else. So I'll put it in the bottom and I'll put it around this plant here. It does hold water, so you shouldn't have to water as often with this. Okay, let's do another one. Purchase these strawberries discounted. When you see strawberries and they have a few bad leaves on them, just take them off. They're very hardy, very sturdy. They last throughout the winter, the plants themselves. Um, so um, just go ahead and um, purchase them and give them new life. And a more cost effective way will be to use seeds. Um, you can also do that as well. I've done both. And if you don't want to purchase seeds um, and you have strawberries, one strawberry can give you hundreds of seeds. And I do have a video on collecting strawberry seeds. I'll insert it at the end if you're interested. Let me know what you do with your strawberries. Do you buy starter plants? Do you start seeds yourself? Do you collect your own seeds? Chat us up in the comment section. When you do these, you want to make sure 
keep this part above the soil. This is the crown. Okay, I have one more left. We made a good bit. So that little block, I would still probably mix it with some soil. If you mix it with soil, it will stretch your soil and also improve the drainage. Again, keep the crown up high. And here are the three plants. If you have room, you can put some mulch around it, but these are fine. This is more like a fiber and they're gonna droop over. But if you have a bigger pot, I would put mulch around so that when the strawberries um, come out, they don't land on the dirt. All right. If you like this content, go ahead and like, comment, subscribe, follow, and share. Thank you for watching. Bye.